Hello everybody, Gamer 2000 here, welcome back for more Mark 35. So this is actually not my video, so don't give me credit for this video. This is actually Nintendo's, Nintendo Movies uh, Mario 35 playthrough of uh, story mode. Um, so this person's actually um, recording this with probably some really good video quality um, capture card. Because, uh, I also chose this because, yeah, um, has pretty good video quality, this person has for all the videos I've seen so far from this guy. So, basically I'm just showing the boards, the two boards that um, haven't been shown in my playthrough. And I'm pretty much just going to commentate over it. So I actually have a failing recording attempt of this um, last weekend. And, um, and uh, for some reason the audio, something happened to the audio, so I had to like redo it some for some reason. So yeah, here we are re-recording it, but that's okay. Because I don't think my commentary was that great anyway. But, uh, that's fun. But, yeah, at least I have plenty of things to talk about. I'm gonna try to finish this playthrough today if I can. If not, then I'll do it on Friday or something. Because today's Wednesday. Today's actually Pi Day, March 14th. Also, the day I actually went out on my first march. It's an anti-gun violence march I went on to. Because I used to... I. Like, the biggest reason why I went was because, um, in my, I had a, there was a lot of gun violence, like, gang violence in my, um, in my old neighborhood. And it's kind of protesting against guns. Finish. Wow, <laughs> that's actually pretty impressive. Draw. This guy's actually playing an intense computer player, which is just crazy. I don't know how you do that. And also playing as Peach. Um, which uh, I wouldn't, but you know, some people would, I guess. You know, I'm not judging, just different opinion on characters. You could say the same thing to me, because I always use Yoshi. So, yeah. Just finished some dairy dural chips, whatever they are, from like like kind of those Mexican chips. Um, yeah, so I went on the walkout also also with my friend and his friends in a group the whole time. It was about two hours. I had the sacrifice. Everybody had the sacrifice time off to skip a, a few classes. It was like in the middle of, uh, wasn't even in the middle of second period that uh, we just left, some of us left, and we just um, went on an adventure. So we walked all the way to University of Washington from Roosevelt. And it was an adventure because I think I, like, I don't know if I already said it, but it was my first one I went to. So... Yeah, there was also one last year for like the Donald Trump one that my friend also went to. So yeah, and then I got back just in time for like, it was about fifth period, but I decided, eh, I'm just gonna go home. Also, I'm gonna save time recording so I can sync up my audio with this video. 4, 17, 18, 19, 20, okay. Just gotta sync that up. It's important because I don't want to out of sync. Because I'm actually watching this video at the exact same time as you guys are watching this video. So I'm kind of just watching it off my computer. Start. Bang. Huh. 13, 12, 11, 10. See, that's another way of syncing up the audio. Say the same time of the whatever happens in the video game, like the clock the timer or say the time of the video to sync up my audio so there's two ways of doing so 
I don't know which one, if there's a more accurate one. Probably same timing as the video game, probably. As in, like, a clock. And you won just by one step. <laughs> Very close. So, yeah, that was an interesting thing that happened today. So, also... I also want to talk about last weekend. Last weekend I went to a memorial. Um, it was on Saturday. Where um, I went. I went because, um, mostly because there's a lot of people I haven't seen for like two to three years. Um, like... My, um... My aunt-in-law's family members who I haven't seen for a while. And it was... A memorial for my aunt Ma's mother who died. I don't remember how many months ago, but I think it's been a few months. So, yeah. And also, I don't know if you guys remember, but there has been a YouTuber called um, Super Twenty Three, and his. And he's actually, um, I actually saw him there. That was his, um, YouTube name back then. I think he changed it. Because that, he doesn't really use that channel name, I think, anymore. Because, you know, he got it, like, I don't know, like, five years ago or so. Back when I helped him get a YouTube channel. But, um, yeah, I actually saw him. I haven't seen him since my... 16th birthday, so it's like a year and a half ago. And, um, he's actually kind of a late, he's kind of a late bloomer, because when I saw him on my 16th birthday, he was 14, and he still hasn't really gotten that tall, or his voice was still kind of high-pitched. But when I saw him, he was actually, like, just, like, about my height, or just slightly shorter, like, like an inch shorter, or about the same height. And he was like up to my shoulder like the last time I saw him, which was crazy. And his voice is a lot more deeper. So he's in a few videos on my channel, you just gotta have to find him. He's the guy. He's in some videos, um... He's in the webcam of us playing Super Mario Bros. multiplayer, if you look that up. But that was like not a year and a half ago. If you want to see him, a recent video, then what, he's the guy with the blonde hair. Um, but that's when he was like, younger in my uh, live action film. Finish. And geez, oh man, that guy, that guy went really fast. Or she, either. Either or. But yeah, that has just surprised me because I knew him since I was like uh, seven years old, about to turn eight, and he was like six. And now he's about to turn 16 and in uh, about a month. So yeah, a lot of things have changed. We've been thinking of maybe we should meet up in the summer and record something for YouTube. And then the live action film was in uh, episode 37 of Evolution of Unexpected Events on my channel. Oh, the super power film. About a year and a half ago. Which is crazy, it's been that long already. But yeah, man, he's definitely changed. It's also <laughs> gonna start the driving, start driving lessons earlier than I did. So yeah. So yeah, that was an interesting day. I kind of went with my grandma and my great grandma. My grandma kind of just flew from Arizona to Seattle to do that. To went to go to the memorial. So it was unexpected. Yeah, these computers are going to be pretty intense. You know, it, it, it is the difficulty intense. I'm not sure if I've ever unlocked that yet. But, uh, yeah. You might have to play, like, story mode with every character, maybe, to get unlock intense mode, because I think I can only go up to hard, I believe. According to what I remember, anyway. 
Yeah, I don't think this this guy will make it. Wow. Yeah, that's crazy. That's a really high score there. So there's about eight minutes left. Also finally edited a video too. Also in the last video, I decided how to edit it. I um, pretty much just fast forward everything I failed and put my rap song over it instead of hearing the fast forward quick sound, squeaky <laughs> fast forward of my voice and the gameplay sound music. Um, and it kind of made it exactly 20 minutes on purpose. Because of the OCD in a way, but I'm not OCD, it just kind of feels like it. Start. <laughs> I remember how stubborn this was to me. She seems to get the hang of it. I'm just gonna call it she because Peach is a she. Finish. And there you go. Peach, I guess, is the winner, huh? <clears throat> so, I don't know, also, I don't know if this, I don't know if uh, this fast forward my commentary, but I was talking about um, my new iPhone in the last video. I don't know if it fast forward over that, me talking about that, but um, basically it's a, I got that as a hand-me-down and had a flip phone for the past, like, seven years since fourth grade. And now I finally got it like about a month ago. Actually about two months ago, almost. And yeah, it's been pretty good. I have internet wherever you go. Except places like the country. With no service. Out in the woods. Depending where you are in the woods. If it's like kind of the woods, but kind of close by the city, it's different. Stop. But yeah, that's probably one of the highlights of what I got. This, uh, I think, this must have been only last night where I, um, Where I went out to dinner with uh, my dad, grandma, uncle, and aunt-in-law to a Mexican restaurant. It's either last night or two nights ago, I don't remember. I think it was two nights ago. Yeah, not last night, I believe. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was. This is crazy because after four months of not recording, there's so much to talk about. So much that I don't know where to start. <laughs> I think I've already said that, so. But yeah. So anyways, see what role you get. So it looks like Peach, Peach has been pretty knocking out these Koopa Kids pretty well for her intense. But also, there is a little bit of luck to it, too. There's also, I don't know if this also fast-forwarded in the last video in Future Dream, but, uh... I believe it was either Red and Green Koopa Kid, or is it... I don't know which ones. But they flashed to different colors at the, on the same screen. Which I don't know if that happened. I don't know if you can hear that airplane in the background, but the door's open right now. I guess because it's a uh, it's actually a sunny day today. All right. Yeah. Hopefully I can, like I said earlier, hopefully I can get this um, playthrough, this let's play done by today if I can. And hopefully nothing happens to the audio this time. <laughs> that would be bad. 
still got my socks over my microphones for getting rid of the p sounds and the s sounds. Maybe the s sounds. I don't know. There's definitely uh, there's definitely a uh, a plug-in for that on Audacity to get rid of that. It's like the specific. It's like the fish something, something fish. I don't know. And this one's kind of an easy mini game to get high score if you're the twister guy. Because you pretty much just go fast as you can and definitely... Because definitely Toad will also be in... It'll make sense if your partner's also on intense mode. With the... As with the computers. And as soon as I get these recordings done... Of me talking over these boards, I'll... Um, I'll start Bowser's Nightmare in story mode and then beat the boss and go over the credits. How could I lose? It's terrible. Well, it happened eventually. It'll happen. Another airplane. Alright. Ten. You lose. You know, it was definitely, I feel like I would learn more from that March thing I went today, rather than going to school. Continuing the school day. Because it's in a, a big, it's a experience. There's also some speeches once I went to uh, the UW campus. A lot of schools went in too, like, there's so many people. A lot of people went. Sometimes I w wonder, <laughs> I almost said uh, wish, but I sometimes wonder, like, how empty some classes would look when you're all gone. Not all of us went, but it looks like a lot of people did. I don't know, this just feels like some people went just so they can, like, hang out with their friends and skip school. Feels like some people. Yeah. Man, wait. Looks like they went all the way up to the end. And there's only. Oh, I think. Peach defeated Koopa Kid. And yeah, so I guess I'll end it here with my video. Not my video, but with my commentary. Not my own video, but you know. Dude, guess I'm borrowing it for this playthrough. Cause there's no way I can like go back and do store, do toy dream. But anyways, this has been um keep feeling like saying Toy Story, but nope, it's Toy Dream. Anyway, see you guys for Sweet Dream. Oh, S. That's pretty good rank. Best rank.